Understanding Piston Installation, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an interesting topic that blends the worlds of language and mechanics, piston installation. This term might sound technical, but don't worry. We'll break it down into simple, easy to understand pieces. Whether you're interested in cars, engineering, or just expanding your English vocabulary, this video is for you. Before we get into the installation part, let's understand what a piston is. A piston is a crucial component in the engine of a car, motorcycle, or any other machine with an internal combustion engine. It's a cylindrical piece that moves up and down inside a cylinder, creating the power needed to move the vehicle. Think of it as the heart of the engine, pumping life into the machine. Pistons play a vital role in an engine's functionality. They are responsible for converting the energy generated from burning fuel into mechanical motion. This process involves four key stages, intake, compression, power, and exhaust. During these stages, the piston moves up and down, driving the crankshaft to power the vehicle. Without pistons, your vehicle wouldn't move an inch. Installing a piston is a detailed process that requires precision and care. Before installation, several steps must be taken, including cleaning the engine parts thoroughly to ensure no debris affects the piston's movement, inspecting the piston and cylinder for any damage or wear, measuring the components to ensure a proper fit. These preparatory steps are crucial for a smooth installation process and the engine's long-term health. Now, let's walk through the basic steps of piston installation. 1. Lubricate the piston rings and cylinder with engine oil. This reduces friction and helps in the easy insertion of the piston into the cylinder. 2. Install the piston rings onto the piston. These rings help seal the space between the piston and the cylinder wall, preventing oil from leaking and keeping combustion gases in place. 3. Compress the piston rings with a special tool called a ring compressor. This makes the piston smaller temporarily so it can fit into the cylinder. 4. Carefully insert the piston into the cylinder, ensuring it's correctly aligned with the engine's crankshaft. 5. Secure the piston by connecting it to the crankshaft with its connecting rod. And there you have it, a basic overview of piston installation. This process is a fantastic example of how mechanical components come together to power our vehicles. We hope this video not only expanded your English vocabulary but also sparked your interest in how things work. Remember, learning a language opens up a world of new knowledge and experiences. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.